This tree is sitting in a bioretention facility, which is a kind of rain garden. So the state of Maryland and Montgomery County are cutting edge when it comes to how you treat the rainwater that falls on a site. And when you're creating an urban site like this at, at Westside, uh, we really wanted to think about how we could capture the rainwater and do the treatment that's important for environmental sustainability in a way that was compatible with the urban streetscape. So this, this is a concrete box bioretention facility that has specialty planting in it that's designed to be able to tolerate wet roots and dry roots because it won't always be full of water and specialty trees that are able to, to tolerate those conditions as well. And it's designed to capture the water that falls on the street, hold it, capture the water that falls on the sidewalk, hold it in a rain event, and then allow it to percolate into the ground. And so we also, we're standing on right now a porous paver sidewalk that does the same thing. And we have, uh, in some of our uh, alleys here, we have uh, porous alleys too, where the water that falls in the alley can actually soak through to the ground. The state actually has pretty, very stringent stormwater management regulations that are implemented by the county. Uh, where EYA had a role was coming up with the technique that we would use to capture and treat the stormwater. So because we didn't want to take half the site and make it a bioretention pond or do, you know, bioretention swales that can quickly become overgrown and unsightly, we wanted something that fit within the urban context. And so the idea of creating these planter beds uh, and planter boxes uh, was something that we thought would be a, a solution that was compatible with that more urban environment. Thank you.